Good morning. Out for my morning walk on a new trail here, sort of. This is an area where they have the hunts at Fort Clark Springs, Texas. And whenever there's a hunt in progress, of course, they close this area here. But here's where I came from, as you can see. Yo, <laughs> hello down there. Anyway, so we'll go over here. But here's a deer blind. You ever see a deer blind? This is just one of the many configurations. There's all kinds. There's up off the ground. There's the tree blinds and all that stuff. Well, what they do, they'll bring a hunter or possibly two and drop them off. And then they get inside the deer blind, you see. And off to the one side, they have what's called a field of fire. In other words, this out here, over here, you see where my stick's point? That's cleared out. There's a feeder. <laughs> you hear me? Deer come to eat, boom. No, buy a deer. Is that fair? <laughs> yes, I don't know, man. It's not locked. Let's see who's in here. Let's see where it's hung up on something. Let's see. Yeah, we got, got a nice swivel chair there. And uh, you sit down in this chair, see? Well, this is for two hunters. <clears throat> but you get in position here. And uh, these windows open. See, you got these little things here. You turn, and the windows lift open. See, old, 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 old uh, Dicky Deers out there eating breakfast or lunch or supper or whatever he's eating. And see, this thing comes up and stays up like that. You see, and then you poke your rifle out there that'll kill an elephant at seven miles. And there's a little ninety-pound deer there. Uh, just enjoying life, and it's during the rut, you know, you know, the mating season for the deer. That's when deer season is, you know, November through January. So here you sit, and you're looking out there, and you got him in your your laser sights, and uh, you blow him to kingdom come, and you're a your hunter. That's it, man. That's how you hunt right here. Pretty neat, huh? And also, you got another window over here. You can lift up and kill one right there by the window. You can probably, well, what this one is for, you can reach out and choke them to death. Save your ammo, okay? And then over here, see, same thing. But see, you got, it's all designed uh, like a, it's, it's, it's a hideout, see? This is hunting in the 21st century. You got me? So with that in mind, you sit here in a swivel chair. Usually you have either a bottle of whiskey or something in here to keep you warm. And by the time you get through with your hunt, you can't get out of your chair, so they send somebody to come lift you up with a forklift and take you back home. And that's hunting in the 21st century. Let me put this door back so it doesn't come open. There you go. But there it is, guys. Deer hunting. This is in South Texas, Southwest Texas. But it's like this all over the world. This, this is not unique, you know, to feed the animals and then kill them. <laughs> Yo. Is that new? No, we feel it feed hogs and feed chickens, feed everything else, and then we murder them. But anyway, that's enough said about that. We'll walk out here by this feeder. I'm just killing time this morning. And uh, let me put on my glove. Well, better not because I got to cancel this video a minute. But yeah, it's a, it's a pretty area. It's a great area for deer hunting because there's deer everywhere, here, even, though, even though you're not seeing them now. Uh, you know, if there was actually some feed being thrown out by that feeder, that feeder's on a timer. Okay, it's got a battery thing, and ever so often it'll throw out some corn. Okay, and here come the deer because they listen for that sound. And when they hear that rattling noise put out by the feeder, here they come. Yeah, pretty neat, huh? <laughs> deer hunter. Yeah, well, you know, it goes all the way back to the caveman days, you know. But anyway, I'm just walking. This is another try. This would be another way to go. In fact, I think I'll go that way going back. I'm not sure where it goes, but we'll find out. So this is a deer feeder. Holds about 50 per 100 pounds of corn. And uh, this thing right here spins, you know, right there. It, that's called a wild game innovation. Well, I hear you. But you can see the trails coming in here from all directions. Hell, the deer never had it so good, you know. 
But anyway, just out for a walk and happened to see the deer blind. And that's probably about 100 yards, you know, and that's about what people sight their rifles in at. And of course, if you got a laser sight, you just put that red dot on the deer where you want to blow a hole in him or it, and uh, yeah, boom, down they go. And then if you're lucky, there's a Jeep or somebody comes and helps you load the thing, and then you field dress it and put the meat away, and away you go, next hunt. But yeah, we're just burning daylight here. Here's some more of those damn cut ants here on the right. And you see all that dirt piled up around that tree? That's ant bed. I'm not kidding. They're not big ants either. They're just little old bitty things, but they're extremely persistent, you know? And uh, do they cut leaves off everything around? Yes, sir. They do. We had them in cotton fields one time. And they'd build mounds everywhere. And we'd put some stuff down in those holes and then light a match, let it sit for a while and light a match. And you'd see smoke popping out all over your cotton patch. I mean, there are holes everywhere. But anyway, guys, from Fort Clark Springs on a cool morning, it's about 35, 40 right now, probably 35. But a nice day, and uh, yeah, here's a trail right here that goes right over that deer blind. <laughs> I hear you, I hear you. Anyway, guys, enjoy your life. Different strokes for different folks. I do me, you do you. Amen to that, and enjoy your life. Thumbs up, carpe diem. Carpe diem means seize the day in Latin. And yeah, out here in the middle of nowhere with nobody but me, myself, and I. Guys, enjoy your day. And, uh, yeah, this is the best walking place I believe I've ever had in my entire life. I'm just tickled to death, nose around and all this stuff. I'm telling you. I can hear the birds. You probably can't hear them in the video. Adios, guys. Bye. Use the Amazon link.